Yeah, whatever. Okay, let's start with part three. We started with whatever. Chug Conroy's number one catchphrase. <laughs> I don't know. Whatever, whatever, whatever. Okay, so this is Cyber Warrior 94. And this is our video on uh, what we our thoughts on the Pokemon Black and White versions. Um, I think these might be coming up ever every so often once a couple of details about the game comes up, but we're done with this part. We're just giving final thoughts. Yeah, we're we're done with it because the games are out in uh, Japan already. Seven, no, it's actually coming out in seven days. Uh. And we're I'm getting in a month after it's out. Which sucks. Yeah. But still. You better do an unboxing of it. I, I can't do an unboxing of it. I don't want to. I want to do the unboxing when I have like a full lot of stuff. The Pokemon games I don't really have, want to. I don't even know what I'll say. Yeah. Oh well. Um, I also am going to do an unboxing of a Blackberry anyway. So, yeah. So, final thoughts of the game. What do you I think we I what I want to see in the game is that you know how we are in caves. Yeah. I what I really want to see is that we go into a cave and you know how you don't see a Pokemon and all of a sudden like zone I see nothing but I'm in a battle. Yeah. I want to see like random Pokemon just covering the cave and then like you're walking all of a sudden this Pokemon jumps out literally in front of you and like, Burr! and then you're like do 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 and you're in a battle with it and you actually see what it is. Yeah, that'd be cool. And like, if you had to repel, all the Pokemon would run away from you, depending on which Pokemon's in the lead. Yeah. Yeah. That would be. That would, honestly, honestly, I would think that is the best of the game. That would be best. My final thing. I mean, Nintendo, you already answered my hopes and dreams with the uh, seasons and stuff. And now I'm gonna take a drink. Uh, Scope, you lead off on what you want to see in the game. Um, in this game, I. Yeah, I'd like to see what you were talking about, and, um, I'd like to actually see, at one point, if Team Plasma would ever have, like, a major victory, where, like, we get defeated as a part of the plot line, and then we have to come back and beat them again. Actually, that did happen in XD, like, uh, the guy beats you, and then you come back, and then you're like, yeah, I'm back. Yeah, I know, like, she stole your, uh, capture device and you have to, like, get it back from him. I know that. Yeah, that's... Ba basically, I was like, what made XD so good? XD's better than Coliseum, in my opinion. Yeah. But, um, also, my thoughts are the Pokemon look vicious. I mean, I had low expectations, but now I have, like, the highest expectations for the, the Pokemon. And honestly, I, I will do basically a lot of things. And oh, yeah, I'd also, uh, if you're a fan of Poke Jungle, um, I just sent in a link of the, uh, basically of an interview, and it was revealed that issue is based off of New York and Arizona, and Poke Jungle is glad that I told her that. Him or her, I don't know. I'm sorry if I offended yeah. you, Poke Jungle. Well, just refer to it as them. You don't know how many people are working on the site. Three. Three. Yeah, so it's them. It's them. It's them. But uh, thank you for acknowledging that, and I'm also glad that these games are coming out. Me too. Uh, <clears throat> let's see. Oh, yeah, the names of the three gym leaders. The three gym leaders look like you're going to be seeing a lot of anime pictures of guys like, I love you and stuff. But that's what I really am not looking forward to. Like, yeah. well... And they look like, uh, how can I say this? Little girls love at first sight. The Jonas yeah. Brothers of Pokemon. And I, I, cause when I, the funny thing was that when my uh, little sister first saw them, she was like, <gasps> Oh my god, they're cute! Okay, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, she'll be addicted to the anime because I told her Dento's in and she's gonna be like, I hate Dento. She loves the water and the fire type, but I don't know why. She just likes those two more than uh, Dento. Yeah, but you can never replace Brock. You just can't. Brock is the rock. He's Barack Obama. Wait. <laughs> no. Brock is better than the president right now. <laughs> well, burn. Burn. What? What? Burn. I got bur fought water burns. Literally. Yeah, boiling water. 
Boiling bottle oh, botter. 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 <laughs> Well, well, yeah, well, basically, we're just spamming a lot of words here. And, uh, honestly, what I think, we think the last dragon type of uh, Reshiram and Zekrom is going to be an ice type gy uh, gym leader. Water, no, what? Ice, ice, ice type dragon Pokemon. I would actually like to see a rock dragon myself. Dra actually, that is a really No, wait, we no, we, need, we definitely do need one type of. Uh, dragon. 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 Flying dragon. Yeah, dragon flying, even though it's on the dog. Oh, right, Rayquaza. Oh, I forgot about That's him. Enough. That was actually just referencing Dragonite and the, uh, Salamence at that point. Yeah. But yeah, also, but basically, that's what I want to see. The third dragon seems like it's going to be incredible. I honestly don't see po I don't see Pokemon Gray happening. I don't see a Gray version. I do, however, see a Pokemon uh, Ice Plasma. Pokemon Plasma. I don't know if that would work because, like, unless you're, they took a completely different, like, a 360 view of like you're uh, you're actually a new recruit to Team Plasma. That would be incredible. That oh yeah, that actually like you play no, you should have like. You play as the main character, but then you go into, like, a memory mode of the bad guy. And he's like, okay, I have to play as the bad guy. This is my team. I'm going to beat you up, bitch. <laughs> that should be in the game. Like, he, like you cap like you capture the bad guy. You tie him down in that chair. And you're, like, you're interrogating him. Like, okay, you need to tell us what you did here, why you did it, and what you need to do. And basically, and you go into memory mode, and you're literally him in the game with his Pokemon. Which would be, it, it seems like it could happen because we actually have a police force now. Yeah, well, well, we did have, if you counted, we do see a police force in XD, but that's not in the main versions. Yeah. And, and I mean, all we've had was, like, the couple of police officers in the, like, the original games, and then Looker from Platinum, but that's it. And, and, and in Looker's assistance, too. Yeah, wait, he had assistance, I never knew that. Yeah, well, you know how you get, uh, Heatran, you get his, his assistance arrest, uh, Ch uh, Charon. Ah. Uh. You, you, oh my god, they have the same name. I just realized that. Charon? What? Action made. Yeah. Um, also, I honestly do want to see, like, a co-op in these games. Yeah, like, you could actually, like, well, I mean, that's what the high bridge is, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Also, I want to see less legendaries, but apparently I got burned. Yeah, because there are, like, what, 23 legendaries just in, just in the issue decks alone? Yes, yes, there is. I hope there's an easier way to get the national decks. Please be easier. I think what they're going to do, just like they did in uh, Pokemon Diamond, is that you at least have to see them all. You don't have to actually catch them. That'll be even more annoying. I have to see all the legendaries. <laughs> that means I have to catch the legendaries. Well, I mean, like, excluding the event ones. Well, like, you know, like, you'd only have to see the... Um, like, there would be three lesser Pokemon, like the spirits in Diamond and Pearl, and then you would have to see the two dragons. Like, Can we just do what one... What you see in-game, and what you would see in, like, a book or something. Basically, I wanted... This is what I think how, is how you should get the national decks. Oh, wait, it actually is a rumor. Is that you should go into the dream world, and it'll be like, oh, you know what, say... Scope, yeah. Um, in the dream world, there's, like, rumors of these out-of-region Pokemon. Can you come and bring Bang back to me? Yeah. And then you bring it back to her, and then you're like, oh my god, this is known as blah blah blah. I'm going to give you the national like so you can capture more of these. That's what I think it should be like. That'd be interesting. Yeah, it's actually like a new turning a new leaf, actually using the dream roll for something useful. Other than getting different abilities on Pokemon. Yeah, I mean, getting how about different regional Pokemon? I mean, you what, you can already capture an Aerodactyl, a Lotad, a Magikarp, a Pikachu, the starters of Kanto. What's, what more? and possibly the other Eevee evolutions. I know Glaceon's definitely been confirmed. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Glaceon, and I think Leafeon, too. Also, Surf looks badass. 
But let's let's discuss what our teams are going to be in black and white. Okay, I have to I have to do it. I'm sorry. I have no clue what my team is going to be, but I'll make that decision once all the names are announced in English. Yeah. Well, my team is going to be uh, the water starter, of course, and uh, black. But the fire, the grass starter is my uh, starter in uh, white. And I will have uh, Shinjiki, the um, the deer Pokemon. Hihi Daruma, definitely. He's the best. Uh, Giga Gaisu, you know who Giga Gaisu is, the rock type Pokemon. Well, his first form is going to be uh, Durango. He's the mantle Pokemon. He evolves to into a second form and then to Giga Gaisu. Then I will. Yeah, and then I didn't like Kibago at first, but then he grew on me, so I will be getting Kibago on my team. Yep. And especially because of his e supposed evolution, I think I will be definitely getting it. Yep, and if you had Zor if you can get got the Zoroark event, you would. Yeah, I definitely yeah. would. And uh, definitely... Oh yeah, and also there's rumored that there's going to be an Ice-type Polar Bear, which is also going to be in my team. Yep. It's going to be... Water. That would make a lot of sense. Actually, it's going to be ice fighting. Oh, that's interesting. It's going to be a force that's going to be just a pure ice type, cute, cuddly polar bear. It'll then evolve into a quite beefy, strong fighting type polar bear. And it'll evolve into a violent, vicious, vulgar uh, bear. And then I think of Imonga. I love Imonga. Yep. I wonder if it will have an even bigger flying squirrel evolution. Oh, definitely. Uh, but I'm not going to evolve it. Uh, there's been new types. There will be a water ghost, fire ghost, and a fighting dark. Really good. There's going to be a water ghost? That'll be interesting. There's also a fire ghost. That's more interesting. I mean, we have, like, Will Wisp. We need a fight fire ghost. Yep. And, um... And finally, uh... That's it. So thank you guys for watching. We'll probably be back some other time to do something else. Yeah, so I'm CyberWare94. And I'm ScopesightCX. And hope you guys uh, hope to see you guys in the next video. If you like this video, like it. If you don't, don't like it. Please don't flag. And also, um, be sure to click in the referral links. Uh, check out to check out more Pokemon information. Uh, stay tuned to my channel or Scopeside ZX's channel. And also, on a quick side note, today is the anniversary of 9/11, so just keep there all the people who had died in the in the accidents in your minds. This is a very important day in American history. Yeah, we salute to those who uh, risked their lives to protect others on that fateful day. Uh -huh. I'm Cyberboy94. And I have Scott Fetzi X. And we salute those people.